Was this the town we encountered the awesome badass guy that kicked me in the balls? <laughs> the guy that kicked you in the I balls? Think, no, I think that was the arena town. Wasn't that the Minotaur? Yeah, that was the no, Minotaur. No, not the Minotaur. Remember the guy in the... Um, he was the, the brigand guy that had the henchman that we slaughtered. And I got all cocky, and I tried to interrogate him. Oh, no, 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 him. that was, that was Fitchview. Okay, just make yeah, sure. That was a different town. I don't remember that at all. <laughs> no, it was the, the time when Tuttagub let the guy pass <laughs> while he was had a knife. Oh, night. okay, okay. I remember now. Cool. All right, well, I'm going to... Uh, Vincent goes to the friends and says, uh, we all good here tonight? We're just going to, uh, in the morning, heal up and perhaps look into that boat? Oh, actually, guys, I left the daggers with the white wizard. I figured we weren't healed yet, so... No, yeah, like I said, he'll he'll identify them through the night, and we should be ready to go in the next day or two, right? Mm-hmm. We promised yeah. to look into Yila's family, and I intend to do that. Oh, yeah, I'm down for that, for sure. I have nothing I need to do in town until we depart. Okay. Um, so, yeah, same with me. Uh, we We have become fairly wealthy with the... The, the recent missions, so I, I do think we should start looking at items to be uh, bolstering ourselves with. Without Tugabut around, our ability to heal is quite diminished, and I'm noticing That's that true. a weakness in our group. We should go check out the town's shop. I agree. So, let's meet up at the tavern in the morning, have our breakfast, and uh, or break our fast, as some would say, and then uh, heal up and go to the boat, yes? Yeah. Mm, indeed. Sounds good. You'll know where to find me if you need me. I'll be uh, sl slumbering now. Sounds good. Yep. I assume we'll just uh, fast forward. Split off. Yep. Gregor, yeah. you want to do anything? I have nothing I need to do. Yeah, me neither. Okay, so. Um... So Neil, I guess I get back to my room and like go to like cast that, and then I realize that I'm missing the. Uh, in the materials for it, and I'm just mm -hmm. like, fuck, and I just go to sleep. Okay. <laughs> Neil, are these okay. the new arrows I got? Are these the sheaf arrows I'm seeing on my character sheet? Uh, no, they weren't on your character sheet before. Uh, I mean, they're, they're sheaf arrows. They're on your character sheet now. I don't unless I published it. They're flame arrows. Oh. Uh, Here, uh, I just wait for it to upload, and it will be there in just a minute. When you shoot them at people, it ridicules them in text. <laughs> <laughs> They're fat. <laughs> the arrow actually it speaks. It just insults. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think you're a dumbass. You're terrible at this. Get it off of me. What is this? Yeah. yeah. But the the arrows are very standard flame arrows. They're plus one to hit, plus one to damage, and they do an extra d6 fire damage upon hitting someone. Very nice. nice. Yeah. And you have 30 of them. And they're retrievable, right? After every shot. No. <laughs> Couldn't he go and get them back, though? Yeah, if you, you can't like, retrieve actually... them at all. They, they burst flame into fire. Guys. Flame yeah. They burst into flames. They, they could be they're... fire infirmary. It's not like they're the human torch, they man. Could. They, they don't just scream, flame on, yeah. and then like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. shoot and hit. What if he shot a, an arrow at uh, Jeff's shield? That's Ooh. a good question. What would happen? It wouldn't catch fire. <laughs> Then could he retrieve the arrow? <laughs> no, because I still would have tried to catch on, catch on fire. Why don't you guys try it and find out? <laughs> I don't think so I'm me and Vincent like walk that. in the next morning, and these two elves are standing there with a bow drawn. He's like, hey, put up your shield. Let's try this. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, Jeff, do you just toss the shield? What's that? Do you just toss your old shield? Um, I guess I would, I would be able to know this, but does it have any value? Can I sell it? Not significantly. I mean, when you have, like, 2K in gold, it's like, you know, you might be able to sell for, like, uh, 2 or 3 gold, maybe. I walk back, as I'm walking back, and I pass by any of the soldiers, I hand it off to them, my old shield. Okay. They take it. And they go, oh, my God, that was Vincent Longborn's shield. Do you see? Look at all the battle. Blah, blah, blah. And they whisper over it. Yeah, see, he could have signed it and sold it for more than 3 gold. I did sign it. So, you um, can write, yeah. <laughs> So I, I actually want to take back what I was saying that I don't have anything I want to do. I want to go buy a backup bow. Well, it's like a shitty, you know, 
little backup bow. Do I have a backup bow? I think I do, right? No, no one has a backup bow. Oh, I thought I well, had one. I'm, I will have a backup bow. Then can I will, I, I, I will too, go get a backup bow. They can only buy one if they call it a bub. <laughs> a bub. Backup bow. Bub. Yeah. All right, Jen, you're buying a second short bow as well? Yeah. And I say to Rigor, I think we should get some rope as well, man. Mm, I have plenty of rope. <laughs> oh, what do they got planned tonight? <laughs> plenty of rope. <laughs> all right, all right, if you say so. Oh, no, there's been a lot of Rigor Abigail stuff floating around the internet. I don't know no. if you guys see it, but in my chat all the time, people are shipping it, Rigor and Abigail. I just I tend the... to ignore it. Try didn't hard you lose can. your your rope because of Tedigam? On my sheet it says I have 50 feet of hemp rope, unless that sheet is wrong. That's an old old sheet. Okay, no, no, let's... it's yeah, it's in your saddlebags, but you don't have your horse anymore. Oh, remember? You left your horse way back in Windsail ages ago. And we have okay. no idea what's all your horses back in Windsail. So does that mean I have I have no rope? You have no rope. Okay, well in that case I agree. Let let me go by. I'm gonna go by like 20 feet. Like Only it, 20 feet? Well, it's because I don't have a horse to carry it. Yeah, yeah, yeah I get out, it, I so. get it. You, you don't need 50 feet yeah. of I would, I, I would totally do 50 if I had a, uh, a horse, but... Alright, alright. Uh, 25 feet of rope. So okay. I also get myself some extra string for my bow. Okay, extra bow strings. I mean, you, yeah. we already have plenty of extra bow strings. Oh, That's okay, not... then never mind, I don't need any more. Yeah. We, yeah, we don't even bother. I ask if they have any uh, enchanted short bow by any chance. <laughs> no. Damn it. No. All right, all right. So I guess as the elves are doing this, I'm going to turn to Vincent and say, uh, so uh, I do know that this is indeed magical. However, This is the next day, I guess? This right? is the next right, morning, right, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, next morning. Um, so I guess we meet up, and I, I'd say I, I know that this is magical. However... Um, in my tiredness after such a long fight, I simply forgot that uh, in order to identify this, it will cost a, uh, uh, materials of about a hundred gold. Oh, quite understandable. Here, let me get that for you. And I gave it to him. I say, perfect. I will, uh, go obtain one of these today and, uh, hopefully have it for you here in the next couple of days. All right. So before you go though, um, sure. So we do need to check on that boat, and, and time is of the matter here, which I'm sure is how you say that. Um, <laughs> time is of the essence. I correct them. <laughs> of the, in this world, we say of the matter. Okay. I don't know. Um, like I need caliber. to get... Right. I need to get healed, and you guys all need to heal up as well. Make sure that Rod gets identified just in case it helps us. I'm going to check out the shops and, and see what our healing options are. But let's try to get to that boat today if we can. So do do this the best we can. Worst case scenario, we go tomorrow, okay? Are we at a point in the town where I can look off into the distance, Neil, and see, like, the shore or anything? Yeah. So do we absolutely. see any boats out in the in the water? Or the, no. the one that recognize, or that's similar to what we saw before? What no, I saw but before? before you guys saw, saw the ship way out by the lighthouse. So you you wouldn't have been able to see it but from the city anyway. Oh, okay, right, so right, right. If you guys right. look at roll 20, we're at the... You guys are currently here at Jestar's Bay. It's not pinging. Why is it not It pinging? landed by the the tavern. Or yeah, the, there ping. you go. Yeah, uh, but the ship was out here before. Right, right. And I, way okay. out there. I remember that. Okay. Yeah. So we'll make our way to the lighthouse again. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, are we all good with this? Can we meet back here midday type of thing? Works for me. Abigail, yes. Bregor... You guys want to get some healing potions? I remind Abigail that Vincent is uh, going to do that. That's his his task today. Oh. <laughs> you are free to join me, though, Abigail. Would you like to okay. join me on that quest? Yeah, I'll come with you. On that shopping quest? Okay. <clears throat> yes. Um, first, we're going to stop at the priest, so you can come with me with that. Spragor, you're going to buy a bub. Or you already bought a bub. Did you buy a bub? I got a bub and a burr, a backup rope. Backup bub and rope. burr. Good, I like it. <laughs> Wait, what? All right, team. Whatever. Let's meet back here in a couple hours. Let's get this done. Heal up. We'll be back right. for this mission. Okay. So I, uh, I start hurrying off towards where the priests are. Okay. And I knock on the door. All right, they let you in. 
Evening, priest. Yes, you notice I still have need Morning, of your services. Sir. Hello. Hello. Um, may I get that healing now, please? <laughs> Can I get my water, please? Absolutely. Once I'm healed, I will retrieve for you the he finest... He chuckles and pats you on the front and says, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You just ah. walked off. It's fine. You are always a kidder. You've always been a kidder. Yeah, yeah. No worries. No worries. Um, so, he tosses some heals on you. Ooh. 14 more HP. Um, on top of the other stuff that you guys have hit, taken... Wait, wait, he just straight up heals them? Yeah, he just straight up heals them. 14 HP. No, nothing... Yeah. Oh, yeah. How long has Jeff known this guy? <laughs> he Jeff worked for him. Jeff just town. Okay, okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Jeff just saved the whole goddamn city. Gotcha. It, I, I was just... I was blown away. Good job, yeah, Jeff. no, because normally they don't... They don't hand out healing. Can we get a uh, HP count? After yeah, that? Yeah, I'm in the middle of updating HP. So Abigail is at 24. Breggers at 38. Vincent's now at 20. Bannon is at 6. 24 out of how many? I think you have 29. Let me, hold on. She I think we're 30 now. Your current HP gen is 28 20. total. Yeah. Mm, all right. Is it the guy I left the daggers? No, this is a priest. Oh. So he did that one heal, and I'm at 20 out no, of what? No, he did those um, two heals. So you're at 20 out of 34. Okay. And he says, um, if you or any of your company needs additional healing, I'm sure the rest of our convent would be happy to assist you. Oh, thank you, friend. Do you mind taking me to someone that could continue the healing for me and my friend here, Abigail? He nods, and you guys get a few more free heals. Four and seven is 11, which brings you to 31. And Abigail, they give you a one and a four, which is five, which brings you to max. Perfect. I feel great. Before I leave, I say, friend, we're looking to purchase... Um, healing items. In the past, we were in the ownership of a healing armband. Uh, an item of that, of that ilk would be fantastic, or even just healing potions. Do you know where to direct us? Um, kind of, Priest kind of rubs his neck a little bit and goes, well, we, we often have healing potions, but we used all of them yesterday, or a couple days ago in the battle, yeah. so we don't, we don't have any more. Um, you know, if you come back, we... You, Typically, we don't offer healing services to just anyone. Typically, we, we only give healing services to those of our to the faithful, and even then, it takes you know it takes a lot of time and energy to cast these spells and to put in to make the material. So we, we often don't you know there there's some charge that goes with it. But for you guys, we can make you some healing potions. We'll, we can. I'll say we can give you two days' worth of healing potion supplies. Fantastic, Whatever we friend. make in two days, we, we can sell you. But we, we, we are still poor. We need the costs to be, you know, we will sell you healing potions for if you can come back in a few days. That Absolutely would be understandable. Lovely. Thank you. Um, you. You haven't heard of these items, though. There's no healing armband in town that I could purchase, nothing like that? Not, no, we, we don't have any of those things. You okay. might want to check Valesburg. They're, they have a lot of magical items there. Very good, friend. Thank you so much for your help. He nods. All right, Abigail, did you have anything as we're walking yeah, out? Yeah, I Do you have anything you want to do? Yeah, the white mage guy. He has my daggers. Okay, I'll yeah, accompany to identify So him. I'm on the That's way there not... as well, Neil. Just... Yeah, but you get there first. So, okay. Bannon, you're there. So I walk in and greet the white... What Do I know his name yet? Did he ever tell me his name? I don't think he did. He never got his name. So I walk in and say, like, greetings. By the way, I never caught your name since I will be looking at uh, your spell book. Can I please have it? Uh, my name is Lab. Okay, Lab. Well, uh, let's, let's have a look at this. I, I kind of put my hand out and reaching for the spell book. He kind of holds it back a little bit and says, No, I will, le I will open it, but I am not letting you actually take it. You, you do understand as a fellow mage that I cannot actually let oh, you of walk course. away with this. Of course. I'll, I'll simply go sit down over there and I kind of point to a table and chair and say, read it while you're in the, the room with me. He nods. He goes, uh, okay. 
kind of looks, gives you like a once. Uh, okay, okay. Um, and he takes you over towards there. Okay. Um, do you want me to just like message you a list of the spells? Yeah. So uh, I guess a question I have is, I, if I read these, do I know them or do I have to like make a copy of it or how does this work? No. So in order to, you can, um, if you, you can read through the spells. Um, you actually need a, a read magic spell to read through the spells, but we'll just say you knew you were going to do this, so you could have memorized that the night before. Okay. Um, so you need a, a read magic spell to be able to read the, the spells, and then you can, after reading them, you can kind of figure out what they do, but that's not the same as learning them. So you would need to make a, a check to see whether or not you can actually learn the spell, and then during that, you would copy it into your spell book. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so I'll just start reading through it, and then we'll kind of go from there. Okay. Um, I'm envisioning like a Neo from the Matrix montage happening. <laughs> oh, like, I read know, read the... spell. <laughs> <laughs> I know Kung Fu. Exactly. Okay. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. Are you at the max number of spells per level already? No, because I think I have like level? three more level two and three more level three or something like that, right? But I'm full yeah, on level you can one. Get, no, you can get one more first level spell. Okay. Uh, okay, so let me just start messaging you. What are the rest of you guys doing in the meantime? I'm accompanying Abigail as we approach the same wizard. Okay. Yeah, we're looking into the, the whole dagger situation. Okay, and what about Gregor? I'm streaming. I'm stringing my regular bow and my bub. And your bub. Okay. You're gonna spend all day making sure it doesn't break. <laughs> I'm also doing a lot of hand grip exercises, things of that nature. A lot of this. Uh, spending some alone time at the end. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Good. Go. Me and my ferret. Yep. Your ferret. My It'll metaphor. come to you, Abigail. <laughs> It'll come to Ryan too. <laughs> well played. <laughs> Neil's done. Role Neil's played, done. Jeff. Role played. Not well. <laughs> Neil's ready for break number one. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. Okay. I'm back. Oh, God. Um. <laughs> get, get, gotta get a resizing cock ring, too. <laughs> <laughs> we love that ring. It sucks. You guys are terrible. Oh, God. <laughs> the ring of domination. Yep. <laughs> so um, while Bannon's looking through the stuff, Jeff and Abigail arrive. Hello, wizard. I, I, I notice them come in. I say his name's. Oh God! Oh, his name's Lab. Ah, uh, thank you. Hey, Lab. <laughs> How can going? I do for you? <laughs> what can we do you for? Um. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um, told this is an old inside joke with my friends. Um, but yeah, I asked you to identify my daggers. I was wondering if it was ready. No, no, I, I had to deal with with uh, Bannon Tears stuff. Um, I, I can start the process this afternoon, but they won't be ready until the day after. Mm, I see. I guess it is what it is, huh? He well, nods. thank you. I will be back. Anything you want to do here, Vincent? Uh, we can wait for Bannon, I suppose. Sure. Well, Bannon, do you, are you going to be here all day, or how does that work? It'll be a while. I'll be ready this afternoon, but uh, okay. Okay. otherwise I'm stuck here till then. All right, we'll meet at the tavern then. Yeah. To the, pa the tavern. Okay. I'm going to uh, stop by the armor, Neil. Okay. And so I think I don't I'm not quite as savvy as these guys here, but I think I've uh I definitely lost my spear and I've lost my two daggers, I believe, right? So I just have my sword and shield now. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay. I'm gonna go in the armor and, and look into his weaponry, I guess. Okay. Um is there anything in particular you're just looking for spear and daggers? Is this is not Valesburg, so they don't have cool stuff like magic items, right? They just have no, daggers and spears. Yeah, they just have standard weapons. All right, I'll, I'll just ask uh, 
if I could buy a couple of daggers, and I'll worry about the spear later. Okay. Uh, yeah, he'll sell you two daggers for two cheap, uh, one gold each. Okay. Purchased, and then I just head to the tavern to go hang out, I suppose. Okay. Cool. Um... No, you know what? I think you still you had two daggers left because before you had four. Actually. All right. Well, then I'm up to four again, I guess. Okay. <laughs> You're up to four again. Cool. Um. Excellent. Uh, Ryan, I do want to mention that you are very you're very close to approaching mediumly medium encumbrance, and now that you, yeah, so currently you and Jeff are both lightly encumbered, mm -hmm. which means that actually you know you are mediumly encumbered. Right, well. Yeah, so right. Jeff, you are lightly encumbered, which means that you move ever so slightly slower than normal. Um, Ryan, you are immediately encum mediumly encumbered, and you're almost heavily encumbered, which Jeez. means that you move at half your movement rate. So to become light, how many pounds do I need to drop? Marty. <laughs> not, the, not the rope. But Breger says this as he's like getting ready to strip off his clothes. He's like, oh, I got to go to work. <laughs> he's getting ready to lift some rocks. Uh, you need to <laughs> drop... 20 or 27 pounds. It's the bright blade <laughs> armor that's so heavy. That's killing you uh, here. Ah, so it's not the rope. <laughs> no. I guess I is Bregor at the tavern. Yeah. So I would bring this up to him conversationally, just noticing that he's having a tough time moving around. <laughs> and uh, with Abigail here with with us, I would say, Abigail, where did you end up getting that elven armor? Because I'm noticing that perhaps that might. We might want to get a, uh, a set for uh, Bregor if he chooses, but it might be better suited for him. Indeed. Did he notice it ever, Neil? Oh, you got You're detected elf. a long time ago, son. Yeah, didn't Tudagub <laughs> call and it And you took, like, arrows and swords and shit to the chest, and we were kind of wondering what that metal sound was and the lack of you dying. And... <laughs> I'm pretty sure Tudagub detected I mean, detected over the it. course of this time, they would have figured it out. It's not like you can keep a secret of, like, armor for months, you know? All right, whatever, so just... Now that I know that they could have known, and be like, where did I get it again? Was it Galesburg? Yeah, you no. bought it from his boyfriend. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, okay, so I know my answer. I'll say, mm. yeah, my ex-boyfriend and I had this really good thing going on until Tadagap mm. ruined it, and he ended up letting me get one of those awesome things. But I think he has more. You guys should uh, should try to get one from yeah. him. Bregor, it sounds like we have a trip to Vales in our future, I would say, but we I did agree. come a long ways here. I think and after we, are... we tie up a few loose ends, then we can head back. Yes. I'll deal with the we'll moderate have to look into the boat. encumberment for now. Okay. Um, okay, so I guess we just spend the rest of the time hanging out in the tavern waiting for Bannon then. Mm. Okay. So, Neil, like, do I just start jotting those down? Um, well, the, so the thing is, you can opt to read. Like, so you can, uh, to learn the spell, you say you want to learn the spell, and then we roll the dice to see whether or not you learn it, and then you transfer it to your spell book. Oh, okay, so, yeah. So, so I have so to pick which you, one I want to learn first? Yeah. And if I learn it, then I can't learn the other one? <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Um, what about the, is it only the level one stuff in here? Or is there other? No, I'm giving you the second level list right okay. now. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to roll for the second one then. And we'll just okay. see how this goes. It's a, it's a random 100, right? A roll 100, right? Yeah. 75 uh, or higher is I don't learn it? Right, because you're not specialized. You're just a black generic wizard. So 75, above 76 to 100, you don't learn. Below 76, you do learn. <laughs> one, All right. One, one, one. <laughs> yeah, this is where we want the one. very good. Um, so I'm going for the second one that I told you I'd write down. Got it. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh. Not learned. <laughs> oh, God. I'm going for the first one that I told you I'd write down. Do it. <laughs> okay, there we good. Go. Good, good. Mm. Perfect. Fuck, man. I really want to do <laughs> Oh, yeah. God. Okay. Um, so I guess the level two stuff you're still working on? Yeah, I'm getting you that list. Um, we could, you know, it's been about an hour. Do you want to yeah, take a break? 
Because otherwise, it's just going to be Neil trying to find this stuff unless you guys yeah. have oh, something yeah. to do. Okay. And there's also my level up abilities that we didn't talk about at all. You need to add 30 points to your thief skills, no more than 15 to anyone. Okay, I'll look into that during the break. Do I get any kind of... Is it next level that I get spells? Um, what? <laughs> Ranger gets spells at... Oh, you get spells? At, at, at. Rangers get spells at... Eighth Resurrect level. Bear. You get priest. <laughs> Resurrect Bear. <laughs> level. Priest and currently spells. you are sixth level, so two more. Holy okay. shit. Yeah, but he doesn't get many. Had you not lost those two levels? <laughs> 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 he casted spells all over the place. It would have been the same level as Jeff at that case, which would have been almost seventh. Damn it. Mm. Hmm. Spells of healing. Okay. It's harder for us manly men to level. Can I learn mend bow? It's not a. <laughs> <laughs> All right, mend Ron, is actually a wizard spell though. Yeah. All right, we're gonna take a break, guys. When we come back, uh, I guess I'll roll for some more spells, which I really am not looking forward to, and uh, then we'll go ahead and investigate the ship, which I think is gonna be at least our first quest of the day. So. Hour one is done. We'll see you guys in hour two in about three minutes. Thanks for watching.